Hey y'all, it's Brienne. I had a great idea. I thought, I'm gonna put curlers in my hair, I'm gonna ride up to the big lots up the street, and I'm gonna get some makeup and do a tutorial for y'all. 80s ladies southern makeup. Tell me that's not fantastic. And I'm only gonna use techniques I grew up watching my granny and my aunts and my mama using. So, here we go. We're going to start, well, I was very upset with the big lots because um, they did not have any Olive Lady. That was my granny's Olive Lady. So, we're going to go with some Pons Spot Correcting Cream. That's how y'all do it. Look, it's Pons. Granny, God rest her soul, even when she passed away. Her skin was so supple, it looked like a baby's bottom. So we're gonna go in good. Oh, up, down, and all over. We gotta have that supple, supple skin, and apparently some supple hair too. All right. Oh, we can't forget, can't forget our neck. Cause you know, Granny's neck was, was, Steel, baby, baby, but smooth. All right. So, I'm going to start. Y'all going to love this. Y'all going to love this. I'm going to start with a concealer. I got one of them spots. Let's just do a little hair, a little bit more hair. Okay, and and I never saw them using sponges. It was just your fingers. So here we go. Ooh, girl. Ooh. Okay. All right. So we're covering up them bags, getting them bags, covering them up, putting them in a recycle bin. Okay, so next step, this one of my favorites, y'all. I used to see my aunt using pan stick. So we're not even going to use a normal foundation. We're just going to get that pan stick on there going. I'm really hoping with this I can channel Delta Burke she is her and Julia Sugar Baker and by sure you know Dixie Carter they are good lord the queens of 80's ladies southern makeup so we gotta make sure we, we don't blend cause they didn't blend in the 80's at least at least, uh, I had that one cousin that didn't. But she's bougie now. She thinks she's bougie. She uses the uh, Estee Lauder. So we're gonna get it all. Gonna get it all on there. You want it as far from your natural skin color as possible. You want to look like a corpse. Okay. So we have that. Mm, mm. We have that, um, that corpse look. That Jack and Sally, maybe um, not of the living dead. So I was very upset when I bought my, my compact it didn't come with a sponge. So, so we're gonna use the brush. So let's go ahead and get all that loose powder. All right, here we go. Get it all in, in all them creases. Let's get some more. Cause we want you to know we got makeup on. We want you to see 
Oh, look at that. Get it up here, but we don't want to blend. Remember, we want our hairline unblended. Mm. Girl, you can see that powder from a mile away. Look, unblended. Ooh, my aunties would be so proud. So next, I'm gonna do the eyeshadow. <clears throat> and I don't have one of those little spongy things. I was so sad when I bought this eyeshadow, it did not come with it. So we're just gonna use our finger, not our pointer finger, our ring finger. Okay, so I'm gonna go in first with a real shimmery, beautiful, what? Make sure you get that frost. Let's get it right here. Highlight that tear duct. Okay, let's get a little bit more. Let's go in over here. My fit, my my skin actually uh, does feel like that of a corpse uh, right now. Oh, let's get a little bit more. Get that frost. Okay, got that frost going. Highlight on that. Oh, can't forget. That's for accentuating the lips. So now, I'm going to go in with a really soft lavender pink. Oh, girl. Only thing that would be better is baby blue. And feathered bangs. this side mm. tell you what give me some curled bangs and some some clip on earrings and call me Bernice get a little bit more So, <clears throat> the 80s were good for another thing. Very thick Brooke Shields eyelashes. I said eyelashes, I mean eyebrows. It smells like a toxic waste dump in here from this makeup. can't see. I ain't got my glasses on. Like Thomas J. Oh, Lord. Alright, so we got that eyebrow filled in. Alright, so we got that eyebrow done. Now, I'm very excited about this. My blush came with its own brush. So we're going to libler, liblerly apply it. That ain't done nothing. That ain't done nothing. Mm -mm -mm. So we're just we're just gonna wing it. We're just gonna wing it. Y 
You want to make sure you get it up in your hairline, <clears throat> but not blend it again. Because remember, we aren't blending. The rouge looks fantastic. So now, I'm going to go back to my eyes. I have my black pencil eyeliner and I'm not going to do a round I'm just going to do the waterline because because that's what that's what I used to see him do oh lord I'm going to go in the anaphylactic shock from this makeup And we just get that water line real good. Don't forget, number one rule, 80s ladies makeup. My dog is currently in the shower. Apparently, he is dying of thirst because this is taking me so long and my door is shut. Oh, girl. And my daughter is sitting right here next to me. So last but not least, I realize I only have half, but I will finish it in return. We're gonna line our, our lips. We're going to line them. Okay, so we're not going to go up and above. We want to make little peaks, little, little, little pointies. Little, just, just little mountains right there. This is the worst lip liner I have ever used. It is cinnamon in color. And I and my sister would be so ashamed of me right now. All right, so we got a little peaks. And now we're gonna go back in with our cinnamon lipstick. Mm. So now, we're going to do the old standby. Y'all remember this one. And take our toilet paper. And blot. So now, I'm not going to make you watch me do the rest of this. I'm going to finish it and get my 80s ladies hair going. And I'll be back with y'all in just a minute. Hey, y'all. I'm back. I have my my curls and my little bit of, little bit of um, volume at the top. But you know, the bigger the hair, the closer to Jesus. Um, also have a slightly damaged look to it. That was a big thing. I don't know about y'all, but my aunties always had that slightly damaged look coiffured. 
but damaged. So um, I just want you to take note of my curls. I did not have any Aquanet. Um, so this is the 80s ladies look. I hope you enjoyed. Bye, y'all.